Hello guys, welcome back. In this video, we are going to talk about dead letter Q of Kafka. We will see what exactly is dead letter Q and how and what exactly the problem this dead letter Q solves. Okay, so let's get started. So first of all, we will understand what exactly is this dead letter Q. So in Kafka, a dead letter Q is a mechanism used to handle the messages that cannot be processed successfully by the consumers. Okay. When a message fails to be processed due to reasons such as invalid format or processing errors or exceeded retries, in this case, instead of you know discarding that messages, we will move that message to a new queue and that will be called the dead letter queue so that that message can be further analyzed or can be done. I mean, it can be uh, further analyzed or manual intervention instead of being discarded or endlessly retried. Okay. So, this is what about the dead letter Q and we are going to understand this with some example. So example is suppose we are having some topic called orders. Okay. Where orders from an e-commerce websites are being produced. Okay. Now there is a consumer which is reading those messages from the order topic and it is trying to write that particular topic in the database. I mean it is updating the inventory or sending the confirmation emails to the consumers based upon the messages which is which it is reading from the Kafka uh, from the orders topic of Kafka right so now suppose uh, the message which our consumer is reading that message is having some invalid data or some error it is causing so in this case instead of discarding this message we will be using the dead letter queue so now we will see the seven steps how we can use this dead letter queue so our step one is producing orders so orders are continuously being produced by the producer into the orders topic okay each order message contains some details like order id customer information and items which have been purchased by the user okay now step two is consuming orders so there is a consumer which has subscribed to this orders topic and it is consuming those orders and it is updating the inventory and sending the confirmation emails or any notification to the customers now suppose there is a processing failure, the consumer is trying to read that message but due to some missing in customer information or unknown item, the processing is failed Okay, and consumer is not able to process this message. So in this case, instead of discarding this message, we are going to send this message to the dead letter Q. Okay, instead of ignoring the failed messages or endlessly retrying, I mean, we will definitely uh, implement the retry mechanism here. But uh, in endlessly retrying, I mean, it is the consumer is trying to retry, uh, consumer is retrying to read that message, but it is not able to. So in this case, instead of ignoring the failed message or endlessly retrying it, the consumer moves some failed messages to the dead letter queue, which is specifically designed for such cases. And we are going to call that uh, dead letter queue as orders underscore DLQ. Okay, we are going to create another topic, which will be named as orders underscore DLQ. So our step five says, analysis or manual intervention in this case the messages which are there in the orders underscore dlq so the engineers or the team of the producer like which is producing this producing this message will do the manual intervention it will analyze that particular uh, message i mean that particular message which has been pushed by the consumer to the orders underscore dlq okay so the failed message now resides in the orders underscore dlq that we see in the previous uh, step right Engineers or administrators can analyze these messages to understand the reason for its failure. It will try to understand why it failed. They might examine the message content, logs or other metadata to identify the issue. For example, they might find the certain orders have missing customer details due to a bug in the order processing system. Okay. So in this case, we can say the manual intervention of the producer team will be there who will be reading the messages which has been pushed to the orders underscore DLQ by the consumer. Okay. So after identifying the root cause, like producer team will see, okay, after going through the logs and everything, they found out, okay, this thing was missing or that thing was missing. They will rectify that message. And again, they will send that message to the uh, actual topic, which was under uh, orders topic. Okay. After identifying the root cause, appropriate action can be taken. Okay. This might involve fixing bugs in the processing logic, updating message format, or contacting the relevant stakeholder to address the data quality issue. I mean, they are going to fix that particular issue 
by fixing the code or by asking some other thing they are going to fix that i mean it's a resolution step we can say after that reprocessing will happen that's what that's what i was saying like once the issue has been fixed messages which were there in the dead letter queue will be pushed it back to the original topic orders for the normal normal consumption so that the consumer can again read that message and should send the messages or should update the inventory or should send the notification to the customer okay so this is all about the dead letter queue in simple seven steps if i talk about like what exactly happens behind the scene so in this video this much only if you like the video please do subscribe to the channel thank you